Hi, it's Anonymous, and today we're going to be talking about multiplying and dividing real numbers. Uh, as you can recall, a real number is any number that uh, appears on the number line. So, for example, this could be 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 to infinity, or 0, negative 1, negative 2, all the way to uh, negative infinity. So, when multiplying uh, real numbers, if we have two positive numbers, say one for example, and we're multiplying them by each other, this will yield another positive number. These numbers don't have to be one, it could be one and five, five and five, two and three. Any positive real number times any positive real number will be one, or another positive real number, not one. <laughs> one times one is one. Now we also can have a negative real number times a negative real number and that will yield a positive real number for example negative one times negative one equals one however if we have a negative real number times a positive real number for example negative one times positive one this will yield a negative real number let's see an example negative 12 times 5 equals what? well we know that the answer must be a negative real number because we have a negative sign here and a hidden positive sign there so negative 12 times 5 or just looking at it alone as the magnitude 12 times 5 is equal to 60. We know this is what must be negative, so negative 12 times 5 is equal to negative 60. Same could be true for uh, a different example. For example, 10 times 6. Well, 10 is positive, 6 is positive, 10 times 6 equals 60. Um, and if this were uh, uh, negative 6, then this answer would be negative 60. So the same is true for, in, with respect to uh, the positive and negative, and those rules for division. 1 divided by 1, or any positive real number divided by any positive real number, will always be a positive real number. Same for uh, any positive negative, sorry, any negative real number and any other negative real number. For example, negative 1 divided by negative 1 will be equal to positive 1. However, if we have negative 1 divided by positive 1, that will yield negative 1. For example, say we have uh, negative 2 over 3. Uh, divided by 5 over 7. Well, this can be written in another way. Negative 2 over 3 over 5 over 7. And this will equal negative 2 over 3. Be careful um, when dividing by fractions. The rule is, when dividing by fractions, to keep the numerator in its form and multiply by the reciprocal of the denominator. So all the reciprocal is, is reversing the fraction. So instead of 5 over 7, we have 7 over 5, which is equal to negative 14 over 15. Let's do a different one. Say we have negative one fifth divided by negative 60. So in this case, we have a negative one fifth and we're dividing by negative 60. Now remember, whenever you see a uh, Real number that is not in fraction form, 
uh, such as negative 60, you always remember that that is over 1. Because negative 60 divided by 1 will still be equal to negative 60. So negative 1 fifth over, divided by negative 60 over 1 is equal to negative 1 fifth times, don't forget to flip the denominator here, negative 1 over 60. So, and this is equal to 1 over 300. So that is multiplying and dividing real numbers. Thanks for watching and it's been anonymous.